Hi everyone, today I will show you, how to fix MW233 files failed to validate problem. Before moving on to the video, you can support me by liking the video and deliver this video to people who are looking for this video like you, let's start. For our first solution, we enter the task manager while Steam is open. And here we right click on the services related to Steam and say, end task. We make sure none of them are open. Now we need to turn off Windows Security and Windows Defender. These two firewalls prevent Steam from verifying files. That's why we need to turn them off. Type Windows Defender in the search. Click Turn Windows Defender in the left menu. We turn off the options here and click OK. Type Windows Security into the search. Click on Virus and Threat Protection. Then click Manage Settings under Virus and Threat Protection. We turn off Real-Time Protection. Windows Defender is turned off. Now all we have to do is open Steam again and do the verification process. This was our first solution. If this solution didn't work we'll move on to the second solution. Our second solution is to delete some cache files of Modern Warfare 2 in Steam. We open the File Explorer. Click on Documents. We are deleting the Call of Duty folder located here. Then press the Windows and R key. Type percent local app data percent into the window that opens. Click OK. In this folder, there are cache files of our applications. We delete the Activision folder. Then we scroll down. We find the Steam folder. In the same way, we delete the Steam folder. While doing this, make sure that Steam is closed. Finally, we need to go to the file location of Steam. Steam is usually located in the program files on the C disk but mine is on a different disk. We go into the Steam file and find the user data folder. We delete the folders inside this folder. In this way, we have reset Steam. Now we will enter Steam again. After entering, we will verify the file. This was our second solution. Our third solution is to repair the disk where Modern Warfare 2 is installed. Type CMD in the search field. Right-click command prompt and click, run as administrator. It's important that you run it as administrator here. If you don't, our code will not work. Here we write the code that I will put in the description part of the video. After typing the code, we will see the letter C here. That C means local disk circa on which disk Steam is installed, we need to write the letter of that disk here. For example, if you haven't made any changes, local disk will be on circa but if you moved it to another disk like me, you have to write the letter of that disk. Since I have Steam installed on the X disk, I write X instead of circa after ty typing, we press enter. Here we press the Y key and press enter again. As you can see, the process has started. If Steam is on the disk where your Windows is installed, it will ask you to do this scan when restarting the computer. In such a case, you need to close CMD and restart the computer once. However, if it is on a different disk like mine, you can do this without closing the CMD. It is currently scanning and repairing files on the disk. We are waiting for the process to finish. Remember, this process can take a long time. Yes, the scan of the disk where Steam and Modern Warfare 2 is installed has been completed. Now we close CMD. And we restart our computer once. Then we go to Steam and verify the game files. Now, if the error is caused by our disk, we will get rid of this error. Our fourth solution is a bit tricky, but I've seen this solution work for many users on Reddit. Our solution is to remove Steam. When we remove Steam, Modern Warfare 2 and all games on Steam will be removed. 
you can back up games you don't want to uninstall, except for Modern Warfare 2. Modern Warfare 2 must be deleted with Steam. After uninstalling Steam and Modern Warfare 2, you can solve the problem by downloading Steam again. This solution will work if the problem is not caused by us or Modern Warfare, but by Steam. As I said, I saw that it was useful for many users on Reddit. A solution that will tire us out, but that will work. We have come to the end of the video. I hope one of these solutions fixed your problem. If the video helped you, don't forget to like the video. You can also subscribe to my channel to support me. Take care, and see you in the next video.